What's happening, Magnusites? Alright, check this out, right? I want to tell y'all about this little situation that happened to me. I was at the club with my boy Will, right? And we chilling, doing our thing, and the club I go to, a lot of people frequent, a lot of the same people go. You know how it is, it's kind of clickish in the club sometimes. So anyway, whatever, I'm a familiar face. Me and my girl are a familiar face in there. So, uh, that was funny, I didn't mean to snort like that. <laughs> um, anyway, so, um, I get up in there and I'm chilling out for a little bit. And then my boy Willie starts talking to this one girl he knows and they're chatting or whatever. And she's got her friend with her. She's black. They're both black girls, right? And he comes over to me smiling and laughing. And he says to me, yo, she was like, yo, her friend thinks you mad cute. But she said, he only fuck with white girls. Bitch, how the fuck you know I only fuck with white girls? Because you see me with one? That's it? And I noticed that this happens a lot. This this happened to me a few times in the past. Like somebody saw me with my girl or something, and all of a sudden somehow at some gathering or party it gets around to me, oh, you only fuck with white girls. How the fuck you? And like, it'll be places where Sarah isn't with me. So it's like, how the fuck you know? Like, damn, how does word travel that motherfucking fast? Just so this is, is basically, look, this is a message to all the black women out there that think like that, okay? Whenever you see a brother with a white woman, that does not mean that he is exclusive. That does not mean that he just mess with white girls, okay? He could just have um, a, uh, what do you want, what do I want to call it? Um, he just has a large palette of tastes, like I do, okay? I like a lot of different types of women. It don't matter to me. Like I said, you know what I'm saying? Then y'all blackball us like we some type of race trader or something. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> All right, so stop jump to conclusion. See, now, if she had to just talk to me or just say, hey, he's cute, then she could have got to know me for a second. Then I could have dropped the bomb. I got a girl, so I can't fuck with you. But now at least she know, and no one's half the battle. You got what I'm saying? You ain't got to deal with all that. He just date fuck, he just fuck with white girls. You know what I'm saying? Like when I see a black woman with a white man, I don't think, I've never thought like that. So I know there's got to be plenty of other black people that think like I do. You know what I'm saying? I see black women with white men every once in a while. You don't see it that much. But when I do, actually it always surprises me. You know, it's just like I see a unicorn. I'm always like, oh shit, I you know. Like it always throws me off for a second. I'm not against it, you know what I mean, nothing like that, but I'm always like, wow, because I just don't see it that much. That's probably why black women watch Scandal so much, because y'all just don't see it that much. But, uh, yeah, I'm just like, wow, and then that's it. And I'm not like, bitch, only fuck with white men. And wouldn't that be the pot calling the kettle black if I said that shit anyway? So get off that ignorant shit and just remember this video. And when you, next time you see a brother with a white girl, just say, hold up. Tyro Magnus said that he might just like variety. You see that, Lisa? That brother likes variety. He ain't no race trader. Mm-hmm, girl, let's go. See? And then y'all can, y'all, they'll stop with all the hatred and jealousy that some of y'all get over that shit. Like I said, with my last video, only 9% of us date outside the race. 9% of black people date outside the race. Interracial dating is not an epidemic. It is not an epidemic. 9%. And I think it's even less with white people. It's like 3% of white people or something like that, okay? And all the other races. 9%. Drill it in your fucking heads. Interracial dating is not a problem or an epidemic, all right? Uh, talk to y'all later.